Billions of people are suffering from the effects of climate change and many of the impacts of the crisis are now simply irreversible, a landmark report. The UN's Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, IPCC, is the most devastating official assessment so far of the effects of global warming on people and the it says that humans and nature are being pushed beyond their abilities to adapt, with over 40% of the world's population are highly vulnerable to climate, the somber study finds. But there's hope that if the rise in temperatures is kept below 1.5 C, it would reduce projected losses. For the first time the IPCC states that climate change is contributing to humanitarian crises as weather extremes are increasingly driving displacement in every region of the world. The showgrounds in Bega, Australia, evacuated due to bushfires nearby, image, AFP via Getty Images. It also warns that droughts, floods and heatwaves will increase in frequency and intensity, with devastating consequences, and all parts of the globe will be. People and ecosystems least able to cope are already being hardest hit, while their vulnerability is set to increase if global temperatures and carbon emissions are allowed to increase above 1.5 degrees, it adds. This report is a dire warning about the consequences of inaction, said IPCC Chair Dr. Ho Sung Lee. It shows climate change is a grave and mounting threat to our well-being and a healthy planet. Our actions today will shape how people adapt and nature responds to increasing climate risks. The rise in weather and climate extremes driven by human activities including use of fossil fuels, has led to some irreversible impacts as natural and human systems are pushed beyond their ability to adapt, the IPCC concludes. Farmers across the tropics are reaching their limits of adaptation to current climate impacts. Flooded street after heavy rains in Kochi, southwestern India, image, AFP via Getty Images. Approximately 3.3 to 3.6 billion people live in contexts that are highly vulnerable to climate change, with large cities on coastlines most in danger, it adds, while some measures to prepare for inevitable impacts are actually heightening risk. Maintaining the resilience of biodiversity and ecosystem services, provided by nature, at a global scale, depends on effective and equitable conservation of approximately 30 to 50 percent of Earth's land, freshwater and ocean areas, including currently near natural ecosystems, the report by 270 leading scientists. The assessment is the second in a series of three reports from the IPCC in the latest review of climate science, which take place every six or seven years for talks over the weekend overran, with international officials and scientists working to finalize the wording as they went line by line through the 40-page report, which will be presented to governments around the world. It comes a little over 100 days after the COP26 summit agreed to increase action to try and limit global warming to 1.5 c, 2.7 f, to avoid the worst impacts of climate change. A bystander looks at wildfires tearing through a forest in the region of Chefchaouen in northern Morocco, image, AFP via Getty Images. Most read. Princess Charlotte's sassy response when an aide tried to help her with a special gift. Elon Musk responds to Ukrainian plea for help by activating Starlink satellites. Ukraine's sailor tries to sink his Russian boss £5 million luxury yacht and has no regrets. It also warns that it is late to reverse some of the effects. Some options for climate-resilient development have already been forfeited due to past societal choices, it said, describing a rapidly closing window of opportunity to secure a livable and sustainable future for all. Russia, Saudi Arabia and India repeatedly objected to the negative tone of the report. They are delaying everything whenever they can, a source close to the discussion said. Russia in particular is trying to emphasize any benefit from global warming and trying to remove mention of climate impacts caused by human activities. Ukrainian scientists left the discussions on Thursday as the crisis in their country escalated. Professor Dave Ray, director of Edinburgh Climate Change Institute, University of Edinburgh. If you wanted some good news for a change, look away now. This latest report from the IPCC provides an even more alarming synthesis of past, current and future climate risks than previous iterations. 
The loss and damage already being caused by climate change is writ large, as is the cascade of intensifying impacts we can all expect to endure in the coming years, decades and centuries. Like taking a wrecking ball to a set of global dominoes, climate change in the 21st century threatens to destroy the foundations of food and water security smash onwards through the fragile structures of human and ecosystem health, and ultimately to shake the very pillars of human civilization. Firefighters use a water hose to extinguish a forest fire in Gonfarin, France, image. AFP via Getty Images. Don't miss. Russia-Ukraine war live. Demands for ceasefire as negotiators arrive and deaths hit 4,500. Chelsea owner Roman Abramovic speaking with Ukraine in peace bid after Russia attack. Hit squad of 400 mercenaries under Kremlin orders to assassinate Volodymyr Zelensky. Princess Charlotte's sassy response when an aide tried to help her with a special gift. There is still time to slow down the wrecking ball, to nudge it away from the most catastrophic path, but with this, the IPCC's sixth assessment of climate change impacts, adaptation and vulnerability, it's clear. Kate Blagojevic, head of climate at Greenpeace UK said, climate change ISNT just a time bomb we're setting for future generations, it can be documented. Right now in the lives and livelihoods lost and in irreparable damage caused to our natural world. Industrialized nations owe the means to take real action to those communities already staring down the barrel of this crisis. The UK government must use the rest of our year as COP president to push the global community to answer the call for action this report is sounding. It's time to stop and reverse deforestation and commit to protecting 30% of our oceans by 2030. We have to accelerate renewable energy and plow forward with energy efficiency measures. And we must reduce meat and dairy consumption in high-consuming countries like the UK. It also means recognition and financial support for the loss in damage already being faced by so many communities on the front line of the climate crisis. Kyle Lishik, client earth lawyer and head of UK, said, This IPCC report is another blunt reminder that COP26 in Glasgow last year was not job done. The UK government must not shy away now, but instead work with even more urgency with other governments and the private sector to deliver more ambition and more. The aftermath of tropical cyclone Shaheen in al Kabura city of Oman's al Batina region, image, AFP via Getty Images. The carbon budget clock is ticking, and the UK government needs to show that its proposed measures will deliver the necessary emissions cuts. As the climate, Change Committee has advised, there is scope for much stronger policy on insulating homes, supporting sustainable transport, promoting climate-friendly food and farming, moving to a low-waste economy, and managing aviation emissions. Professor Simon Lewis, Professor of Global Change Science, University College London, said, This report was commissioned by the world's governments, who have now signed off on the conclusions. Let's hope they act on it, as the conclusions are. Shockingly grim. Read more. Freak weather. UFO-like spinning disk of ice. Terrifying waterspout. Apocalyptic supercell cloud. Exploding shooting star. Similar articles to this. Protect peatlands to save planet. They're our most important carbon store. Food shortages and landslides in Nepal as teens call for climate action. 1. Comments. 4 million homes eligible for a £25 a week heating discount, see if you qualify. 19. Comments. Steel campaigners demand action for £2 billion industry after latest government talks. 3. Comments. Steel campaigners call for help cutting pollution after Johnson's warm words. 1. Comments. Superdrug undercuts boots with £1.99 COVID tests as PM axes free lateral flows. 10. Comments. Everything you need to know about the impact of Ukraine crisis on UK households. How to get the £150 council tax rebate paid into your bank account first. 5. Comments. Join us live as we discuss all of the energy help you could get amid soaring bills. Steal campaigners to pressure ministers for help in cutting industry pollution. I've just had COVID. Ending free tests is a bad idea and hits the poorest hardest. 2. Comments. 
Mom of two, 31, unable to pay for carpets or heating fears energy price rises. 40. Comments. Protect peatlands to save planet, they're our most important carbon store. Food shortages and landslides in Nepal as teens call for climate action. 1. Comments. 4 million homes eligible for a £25 a week heating discount, see if you qualify. 19. Comments. Steel campaigners demand action for £2 billion industry after latest government talks. 3. Comments. Steel campaigners call for help cutting pollution after Johnson's warm words. 1. Comments. Superdrug undercuts boots with £1.99 COVID tests as PM Axis free lateral flows. 10. Comments. Everything you need to know about the impact of Ukraine crisis on UK households. How to get the £150 council tax rebate paid into your bank account first. 5. Comments. Join us live as we discuss all of the energy help you could get amid soaring bills. Steel campaigners to pressure ministers for help in cutting industry pollution. I've just had COVID, ending free tests is a bad idea and hits the poorest hardest. 2. Comments. Mom of 2, 31, unable to pay for carpets or heating fears energy price rises. 40. Comments. Protect peatlands to save planet, they're our most important carbon store. Food shortages and landslides in Nepal as teens call for climate action. 1. Comments. 4 million homes eligible for a £25 a week heating discount, see if you qualify. 19. Comments. Steel campaigners demand action for £2 billion industry after latest government talks. 3. Comments. Steel campaigners call for help cutting pollution after Johnson's warm words. 1. Comments. Superdrug undercuts boots with £1.99 COVID tests as PM Axis free lateral flows. 10. Comments. Everything you need to know about the impact of Ukraine crisis on UK households. How to get the £150 council tax rebate paid into your bank account first. 5. Comments. Join us live as we discuss all of the energy help you could get amid soaring bills. Steel campaigners to pressure ministers for help in cutting industry pollution. I've just had COVID, ending free tests is a bad idea and hits the poorest hardest. 2. Comments. Mom of two, 31, unable to pay for carpets or heating fears energy price rises. 40. Comments. Protect peatlands to save planet, they're our most important carbon store. Food shortages and landslides in Nepal as teens call for climate action. 1. Comments. 4 million homes eligible for a £25 a week heating discount, see if you qualify. 19. Comments. Steel campaigners demand action for £2 billion industry after latest government talks. 3. Comments. Steel campaigners call for help cutting pollution after Johnson's warm words. 1. Comments. Superdrug undercuts boots with £1.99 COVID tests as PM Axis free lateral flows. 10. Comments. Everything you need to know about the impact of Ukraine crisis on UK households. How to get the £150 council tax rebate paid into your bank account first. 5. Comments. Join us live as we discuss all of the energy help you could get amid soaring bills. Steel campaigners to pressure ministers for help in cutting industry pollution. I've just had COVID, ending free tests is a bad idea and hits the poorest hardest. 2. Comments. Mom of two, 31, unable to pay for carpets or heating fears energy price rises. 40. Comments. Protect peatlands to save planet, they're our most important carbon store. Food shortages and landslides in Nepal as teens call for climate action. 1. Comments. 4 million homes eligible for a £25 a week heating discount, see if you qualify. 19. Comments. Steel campaigners demand action for £2 billion industry after latest government talks. 3. Comments. Steel campaigners call for help cutting pollution after Johnson's warm words. 1. Comments. Superdrug undercuts boots with £1.99 COVID tests as PM Axis free lateral flows. 10. Comments. Everything you need to know about the impact of Ukraine crisis on UK households. 
How to get the £150 council tax rebate paid into your bank account first. 5. Comments. Join us live as we discuss all of the energy help you could get amid soaring bills. Steal campaigners to pressure ministers for help in cutting industry pollution. I've just had COVID, ending free tests is a bad idea and hits the poorest hardest. 2. Comments. Mum of 2, 31, unable to pay for carpets or heating fears energy price rises. 40. Comments. Powered by. That farmers across the tropics are reaching their limits of adaptation to current climate impacts is alarming. As is the statistic that 4 in 10 people are. Highly vulnerable to climate change. Investments and interlocking policies are needed to have carbon dioxide emissions this decade and invest in adapting societies to the new reality we face saw increased heat waves, extreme rainfall events and droughts that climate change is bringing. Slashing emissions and investing in making societies resilient to climate impacts could put the world on a sustainable footing. But where are the policies to Show that countries are taking this existential threat to human civilization seriously? Countries have a record of decades of climate inaction. Governments need to step up and act fast.